Wink! Thank you! What's up, Ball Nuggets? Name's Dirk Hammerstein, right? That's a good name, dude. Uh, I'm here to tell you one thing, and one thing alone, and that's that it's back, baby! The cesspool is flush, ripe, you might want to say, with all that feces stewing on the internet. So let's get started with the first thing. What have we found in that place we call the Nets? So I want to start off with a recent Google search that I that I did. Mm -hmm. uh, normally I jump on Google and look for porno. Yeah. But this time I looked for dildos. Uh, because we are on the quest for dildos. Yeah, yeah, we need to find some uh, set props um, that are massive. Oh, corn dildo. Come on, man. Come on, man. Look, I realize everybody's sticking all kinds of shit up their culos nowadays. Yeah, what is that? Dragon dildos, tentacle dildos, horse. dragantical dildos, yeah. horse dildos. Yeah, how's that a thing? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Seen it, but how's that a thing? But I feel the line should be drawn at maybe like a zucchini dildo because corn yeah, brings dude. in this element of uh potential shall we say butt nuggetness there's ridges there's ridges there's crevasses <laughs> there's 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 nooks definitely some crannies yeah and uh last i checked buttholes tend to have feet in them yeah, now, especially dude butts. You might want to argue that, well, who's using it in their butthole? Most people do the vaginal nah. thing. Trust me, I guarantee you that like at least 67%, if not more, of dildo sales are towards dudes. I feel like whoever, I feel like 99, no, you know what? I'm going to go out there, dude. 100% of people who buy a corn dough are dudes. Yeah, I feel, <laughs> I, I, was, I wasn't going to say that. Uh, but I stand by that. Yeah. I feel like 100% of the people that buy corn dildos are definitely going to dedicate it to their asshole. Yes. Because at that point, you've reached levels of degeneracy that you know you just can't come back from. So in that case, short of you using the infamous drill dough trademark, uh, there's no way Kaka is not going to get, <laughs> get up all in them fucking kernels, man. Also... You can't see it here. It's got corn balls. It's got corn balls. Don't insert it because that completes the entire phallus. Yeah. But it's got corn it's balls. It's got man. corn balls, dude. They should have been popped corn corn balls. Oh, oh never mind, never mind. That's gross. Oh, damn. <laughs> Remember when Marilyn Manson was a Chippendale stripper? Ah, oh, damn, Marilyn Manson. <laughs> Look it up. Man. I was thinking more of uh, M Night. <laughs> <laughs> Night Shyamalan, remember that fucking midget from Fantasy Island who got fucking ripped as shit? Damn, dude. <laughs> What's up with this guy, He's man? He's straight Oompa Loompa. Damn, yeah, for real, man. We got a little uh, car. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, them wheels keep going though, Look at right? That shit, dude, just rips off. <laughs> Damn, some good ass wheels. <laughs> I saw this shit in the middle of the night last night, and I couldn't stop laughing. Dude. <laughs> what the fuck, man? Yeah, How does shit. this even happen? I don't know. Oh, I gotta get props. I need those wheels. I'll yeah, tell you that. Shit. Those guys are definitely dead. <laughs> Not even like a single screw was holding this shit together. <laughs> well, one single screw. <laughs> well, that's pretty great. Next. <laughs> Look, I'm not gonna lie, dude. If I had a fucking motorbike, it would look. That's right, a motorbike. Uh, it would definitely look something like this. It would be highly inconvenient. Yeah, dude. To look at and to the touch. And uh, the worst part is that the person riding behind me, and there would be, would be getting like 360 degrees of garlic pit smell. <laughs> yeah, dude. Rammed up their fucking nostrils. Straight long arm. Uh, I feel like if you do, whenever you turn, you have to let go of one end. Yeah, man. This is like highly inconvenient, but yeah. uh, at the same time, pretty player. Yeah, that's like the player's move. Imagine being at the old motorbike club with your fellow hooligans, yeah. and you roll up on this bitch. It'd be like homie. Instantly shank you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> with their with their with their corn dildos. <laughs> corn dildos, dude. Uh, next. Oh! oh! So we've seen this before. We've either, we've yes. seen the ass ends. Someone found at a Goodwill the whole set. Why is this? Why man? is this a thing? It, it's in case you can't tell. It's 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 babies in a pea pod, pod. and on one side you can see their 
fucking abhorrent faces and racist faces, by the yeah, way. Yeah, no shit. Look at that Chinese one, man. Yeah, dude. Straight out of the yellow kid. And then on the other end of the spectrum, you see literally the end the, the, of their spectrum, the aka assholes. their fucking culo. This is the worst, man. I feel like it's neither fun, whimsical, or decorative. Yeah, that's a lie if I've ever heard one. This is so ugly that even pedos couldn't get off this ah, shit. Ah, dude. This is horrendous. I want to meet the person who buys this. Who freaking made which this shit? clearly is uh, like a middle-aged woman. Right? Oh, yeah. Big time. Those Chinese ones are out of there, man. <laughs> who does that? <laughs> they deep fry it and add mayo. And add adds fat. Shit, whoever oh, buys this, dude. This is repugnant. This is the worst fucking thing since, oh, I don't know, Jared. It's Chinese. And I meant Leto, not the other one. Oh, yeah, dude. I don't think babies have hairy assholes. I don't think babies have hairy gams, assholes, pit. I think, like, the alarming amounts in the fucking caca hole is the scariest yeah. thing. There's no way feces will come out at that point. Uh -huh. You just have, like, this big clot of... Fucking shit and hair. Shave that caca hole. Yeah, <laughs> shave that caca hole, thong guy. So the gimmick of this, I guess, is that you can shave it. Mm -hmm. But the horrifying reality is, the second you shave it, you're just gonna have holes. Yeah, that's true. With You're gonna have gross a small holes. amount of hair. In also, them. who gives any sort of shaving device to a kid? Yeah. Anyway, next, stinky. <laughs> God, <laughs> this damn, is one of my mommy. favorite pictures of all time. Like, uh, I've been to a concert, and I've done some cringy shit, believe you me. There's stories of that up already on, on our channel. Um, but I would be devastated if I was as happy as this girl. Girl, right? I think it's a guy, dude. Is it a... No, nah, it's a girl. It's Look at the, the hands. Ha hairy arms, though. What? Girls have hair on their arms? That's dude hair, dude. I've seen some dude hair. Maybe it's a gay guy. Maybe, yeah. That's okay. very possible. Uh, well, whatever. It, it is Beyonce. The point... Yeah, that is a good point. Bayhive got all kinds... Especially gay black guys yeah. with long legs and skinny jeans. Nice ass legs, too. <laughs> anyway, I feel that if I was this fan and I was so happy to see, like, my idol, apparently. And uh, later I found this photo. Yeah. <laughs> her dude, I would totally, like, want to die. She clearly wants to kill her. No, she's just disgusted, dude. And, uh... Uh, maybe we mentioned this in the previous video, but I went to me and the Guardian went to a uh, Shakira concert where this kind of happened. Yeah. Uh, now it, uh, it was kind of in a way worse, but not. I think maybe this one's worse because Beyonce's just like disgusted with at your, the yeah with your the existence. Yeah. yeah. The yeah exactly the very existence is disgusting. Right. I think that's worse. Yeah. But the Shakira incident was almost on that level and it was this she was going around singing and every now and then she would stop and, and you know put the microphone in somebody's face and they would sing along as people are wont to do in a concert and uh they had a camera guy following her so everywhere she stopped you could see the people and shakira up on the huge titantron and she comes up to this person and uh, you know she's, she's she's singing and and she transfers the microphone over to the person's fucking face basically and the person gives forth the worst rendition of any lyric ever. Like, let's say the lyrics were, I like this aardvark. They sounded like this. <laughs> like, literally, that's yeah. how not the lyrics they were. And uh, the camera guy pans over to, to Shakira. Or really didn't have to pan over that much because they were both panning in the frame. And Shakira's face went from, like, joy... To like utter, like existentialist, yeah, fucking like uh, I caused this. Yeah, like I ended the universe with this <laughs> event right here, yeah, and it was uh, both hilarious and incredibly embarrassing for the oh, person. No, like you felt the embarrassment, but this—it's just your face yeah, causing dude. disgust. Shit, I don't know, man. Next, uh, you want to buy some Lost Parks, dude? <laughs> Hey man, fifty bucks for for parts? Hell yeah, dude! Is that fifty bucks or, or fifty? It's uh, like some weird. Uh, uh, what's a pee? A uh, pants? Either way, fifty it's anything too is too much, much for a wasp, wasp parts. Part. I want the full wasp for that much. I feel, <laughs> I feel like you put in a good amount of work putting that wasp into pieces, though. That's true. It's pretty labor? neat. Yeah, it's yeah. A labor. You know, pretty neat wasp. Uh, 
uh, dissection going on here. I mean, we're in the plague season, so uh, I feel that it's uh, free for all. And I feel that if you're gonna make a statement, it might as well goddamn be this. I am ripped, I have a fucking thong, and I'm gonna pick your corpse up and throw yeah, it away. dude. You know, I like plague, doc too, I like plague doctors, but I also like beefcakes. <laughs> so when you combine them... Plague cakes? Yeah, you got the... You got plague winning. cakes is also what I call my turds. Ah, dude. Mm, ah, dude. Homie. Dude, okay, look, man. We found this in the in the in the toy sales group, and it's the pits. It sucks. Okay, if you're not familiar with toys, then this makes you not want to be familiar with toys. This is a guy that's selling this shit for like seventy dollars. Yeah, and it's just like two pieces of freaking wood, a twenty dollar Hulk figure, which he destroyed the entire value of by bolting it down to this wood. Yep. And like a three dollar mask. Yep. That's it. That three dollar mask. Literally a kid's mask that looks super cheap. Uh, it's lit here, so it looks less cheap, but trust me, it looks super awful. Cheap, yeah. It already looks awful, don't get me wrong, but bolting shit onto boards is not art. No. You know? You've and done then, nothing here. Dude, you He didn't even paint the freaking wood. Yeah, the wood's... Yeah, it's two different pieces of wood that don't match. Yeah. And you just paste or bolt things onto them. It's not art. And he's done more, dude. Uh, he did one with... Uh, uh, it was a meme where... Like uh, a really shitty meme. But um, it's like Jesus with superheroes. And he's like uh, something along the lines of... I saved the world once or some shit like that. Uh, you know? Well, he replicated that with toys. But the Jesus was this tall. And the ju he did the Justice League. The Justice League was... The, oh, you know those on your channel? You did those... Ah, oh, the those little Dollar Tree ones? The Dollar Tree uh, yeah. Justice League? A dollar each. And really, they're not worth that. No. Plus, this cheap, shitty-looking Jesus uh, on the board. <laughs> and he was charging 90 bucks. Dude, this guy needs to die, dude. Yeah, he's... In fact, we'll have more of his yeah. art in other videos. Hell but yeah. anyway, uh, next. Interestingly enough, along the same lines, we got this uh, a horrifying beast. Yet another toy group we uh, belong to. And uh, look, man. You oh, know, you like this one, don't you? I am a fan of apes. And this... I hate what has happened. Yes. But the mere fact that it has an ape head kind of makes me want to like it. It's not. Cool, I've forgiven it for its sins because it has got an head. ape head. However, I hate it. Ah, uh, dude. So this is from another toy group that we belong to, and uh, people make custom shit. We don't want to hate on people's art unless uh. it's just shit pasted to boards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But this is supposed to be David Bowie. I didn't know David Bowie had one huge tooth. <laughs> Like, I'll give him some credit for, like, the little bolt. That looks okay. But damn, that tooth, homie. I feel like it looks more like Tilda Swinton than... Yeah, the, dude. But again, the one tooth thing. The one tooth? No one on Earth has one tooth. Except Jughead. Oh, Next. True. Uh, okay, so this right. is a little uh, this is a little sub cesspool. All right. Sub cesspool? Uh, people of Walmart style. All right. People of Walmart. Hit me. We got a couple. We got a... Uh, you're a shoe guy. I'm a shoe guy. Uh... I like a stripper heel, but yeah. it's got to be in a porno or a strip joint. Outside of a porno or a strip joint, stripper heels can eat my fucking dust. I hate it when they're outside of those particular venues mm -hmm. because they don't make sense True. in those particular in anything but those particular venues. Also, you gotta have a slam and bod to pull yeah, that off. Dude. You know what I'm saying? Also, the fact that she's clearly trying to balance with the cart and oh can't, yeah, you can't walk. yeah, those things are near impossible to walk in. Um, I'm sorry, but uh, first of all, this is like me wearing a fucking pair of these things. Uh, be Nobody wants to see that. Uh, Although I, I pretty much rock it. Yeah, I'm just gonna say that. So I give her and her choice zero stars. Would you bang? No. What about uh? Oh Sponge God! <laughs> like Sponge Cola. There's so many pictures of this one person. Uh, Damn, I'm, a, I'm hoping the same day. Otherwise, nah, dude. She probably wears this suit every day. Yeah, she probably thinks that the attention she gets is complimentary, but really, it's nah. like this is a thing I have to picture. Yeah. Uh, 
I'm gonna be honest with you, this is disgusting, man. This is, you know, as a fat person, I can tell you. You gotta, you gotta pick your clothes. You got, yeah, man. Dude. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like I know. Maybe I'm not it's... trying to fat shame, but uh, fuck that shit. Looks gross, man. <laughs> I wouldn't wear that shit. <laughs> I think I would, dude. Damn! <laughs> and, uh, the tie would be a streak of mierda. Yeah, homie. <laughs> would you bang though? Oh hell yeah, dude. <laughs> oh man, bro. No. Take that as truth. I would bang this, truth. this oh. back ass. Dude, that ass doesn't even fit inside the jeans, and I don't mean that in a good way. No, oh, dude. I think it's like her back, dude. Hold on, zoom in on her like upper body. I'm like confused by this shape. Yeah, it's weird, right? What the like, fuck? Like, look, I think that I think she's I think it's a chick. I think she's got Hank Hill butt. And I think that No, those shorts are too small, first of all. And then on top of that, she's got a little gut action. Yeah, right? but look, I think this is the back. Like, you don't see a crack there. I think the ass is on the Oh on the, no, I think uh, you're on right. The Hank Hill butt. That's just like the you know, like the little hams. Yeah, like I think she put the thong all the way up there to make it look like she has an ass. But she's just straight Hank healing, dude. What's she buying anyway? Body, body jewelry, jewelry, dude. Ah! That just means you're gonna display your bod. She's gonna vajazzle. I, again, I'm not trying to body shame here, but uh, that's like me wearing yeah, that shit. Dude. It doesn't look good, man. Yeah. If I'm sure there's somebody out there with this exact body shape that knows how to dress to make it look good. Yeah. But she, however, is dressing like a fucking turd, so it doesn't look good. <laughs> Next. What about this dress? Damn, that's my style right there, homie. <laughs> Damn, dude. Straight up long hot making it seem <laughs> making it seem like you don't have underwear and shit. She doesn't. No, it's that she's got the gut hanging over, so you know, it doesn't look like she has underwear. Ah, uh, homie. I feel like anyone who goes out to Walmart wearing this shit does not wear underwear. <laughs> look at that. I'm not you know what? I'm not even hating her game. It's awful. It's bad, dude. But it's kind of like... It's kind of play -a. I'm, I'm not yeah, going to lie. I feel like it'd be play if it was a dude. But like a chick with a freaking kid, dude? Nah, I think... Like, I did shit, homie. I'm going to give this a, a play -a. Damn. Would bang? No, nah, I wouldn't bang. I'd bang it with a fucking 2 by 4 maybe. <laughs> I don't know what's going on here. If you know this, this, this language, I guess. But all I can guess is... That this kid is arguing with his dad, who's filming him throw a tantrum. Mm. Because I think anybody's been there, you know. You know, as a kid, you throw a tantrum. The tantrum, I'm sorry. They try to throw that shit back in your face by showing you how stupid you look. Yeah. I think that's what's going on here. And the kid was like, "Oh, fine, I'm gonna do this." And then this happens. I'm cutting this baby. Yes, he's yelling. Damn, yeah. oh, 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 dude. If I was his freaking dad, I wouldn't even take him to the hospital. Dad's not giving a shit, really. I'd be like, dude, you have to live with that shit. <laughs> Damn, like a, the, the straight-up arrival arm. Yeah. <laughs> like arrival arm. Uh, I don't know the situation, but I feel like like he deserved it. Yeah, dude. I don't know. Yeah. It's just a gut feeling. He did. I got a lot he of gut. It, dude. Next. Oh, if you didn't like this video, this following video. It's just for you. Yeah, dude. Suck on my fucking testes. It doesn't play, but I'll insert it <laughs> <laughs> when I edit this. Uh, this is, uh, of course, Hard Rock Nick. That's where I get my dick sucked, ass eaten out, balls tugged on one by one, and... And uh, kind of a legend of the internet, and uh, literally one of the worst people on the planet. But uh, <laughs> somehow, somehow, it's become acceptable to be him. Yeah, dude. Um... He's the worst, but there's just something about him that's endlessly entertaining, and it's not the gigantic polo guy on his shirt. Suck on my fucking testes. Damn, homie, that's a big-ass polo guy. Also, he got that beer game from AB. Yeah, clearly an AB Quintanilla fan. Uh, so anyway, I think this is it for this cesspool, guys. Thanks for uh, doing another one with us. Uh, we've been looking to bring back the series, but, you know, uh, we're also doing a bunch of other videos. So, But here it is. In a super-sized form. Indeed, indeed. They're just like us. But anyway, uh, let us know what you think about this. Hit like, share, subscribe, and there's a notification bunch of good work. Suck on my fucking testes.
Oh, I'll count the shit for you.